Corporate Grenada continues to support the restoration efforts of five families recently affected by the devastating fire in Shanty Mel St. Patrick. On Tuesday, the Grenada Cooperative Bank and the Hubbard's Grenada Limited presented checks of $20,000 each to the Shantimel Fire Victims Relief Committee to aid in the reconstruction of homes. 17 members of the community were affected by the fire on March 28th. Immediate intervention by government and the parliamentary representative, Honorable Joseph Andal, saw three families temporarily relocated to the low-income housing unit at the villa. Since the incident and the many calls for assistance, the families have received the clothing, food and other necessities to be comfortable in the interim. At the handover ceremony on Tuesday, Parliamentary Representative Andal said he is happy that the recovery of the affected families is now on the agenda of every Grenadian. I say a heartfelt thank you to Corp Bank and to Jonas Brown and Hubbards for their generous contribution towards the Fire Victims Release Fund. As much as the donations have been coming in, we are still a long way from what we need in order to be able to restore the homes of the five families. And we understand that the attention span of the public is not always very long. And while the focus is on these victims, we need to capitalize on every opportunity to raise as much funds as we possibly can so that by the time people's attention starts to be diverted by other events, we will be well underway to achieving our goals of having them back in their homes as soon as possible. Executive Manager of Finance and Wealth Management at Corp Bank, Dr. Aaron Logie, made an appeal for more businesses to get on board to expedite the reconstruction and recovery process. It's an important opportunity for us to be here today and to make a contribution not to restore um, in its entirety because with a fire there are some things even though you rebuild you're never able to, to get back. There are many valuable items that you cannot put a dollar value to. So today, Greenwich Cooperative Bank is pleased to announce that we are making a contribution of $20,000 for the restoration of uh, the houses that were destroyed by the fire. We make a special appeal to our corporate citizens, our corporate organization, to come on board to help make a difference to restoring what the fire would have damaged. Hubbard's representative Wayne James said the donation will cover appliances and building supplies for the families. As we take our corporate responsibility very seriously, we then contacted one of our partners, our new suppliers, that is, which is, um, um, we are now the supplier, sole supplier of, of a, a new type of cement into Grenada, which is called Argo Cement. And I'm sure you might you seeing it somewhere around in Shantimel because it is sold um, by Ellie Postle and other partners. And um, we contacted them, and again, in reaching out to them, they said yes, go ahead, All right? And we are grateful for them as well in partnering with us in such a noble venture, All right? Um, and today I'm here on behalf of Hobbits and the management of staff and our partner, Argo Cement, to pledge a contribution of $20,000 in the form of building materials household appliances, which we hope will go a long way in restoring the lives of the fire victims to a form of normalcy. The Shantimel Fire Victims Relief Committee was appointed by Honorable Joseph Andal to spearhead the affairs of the affected families.